1940s, and this is why they roared. The Miss America pageant started out as a promotional gimmick. Dreamed up by Atlantic City businessmen in 1921 as a way to keep tourists in town after Labor Day. Over the next eight decades, it would become a national tradition dedicated to defining the ideal American woman. My darling, my in sweet so -and -so. Year after year, the Miss America pageant would struggle to pull off a delicate balancing act objectifying women while providing them with real opportunities, promoting traditional roles while encouraging women's independence, glorifying feminine modesty while trading on female sexuality. Along the way, it would come to be a barometer of the nation's shifting ideas about American womanhood. But in 1921, Atlantic City's businessmen were simply trying to turn a profit by capitalizing on the country's fascination with beauty. There are many beauty pageants in the 1920s, and they range from pageants oriented towards African-American women, Miss Bronze America. Even the Ku Klux Klan has a beauty pageant for Miss 100% America. So there's something about beauty as a symbol that is extremely important and many different groups are getting together and saying we have the most beautiful woman who represents us and Miss America is the national symbol of what is going on all over the country. 